Hi, my name is Micah Craddy. I'm an intern here at Outside Magazine, and I'm going to show you guys how to instantly freeze a beer. Um, so the first thing you got to do is get a beer. Uh, clear bottles like Corona work best, so you can actually see the freezing uh, taking place right in front of you and impress your friends. Um, so once you get your beer, it's important that you don't uh, swirl it around like this or anything. You don't want to get any bubbles at the top or else it will freeze uh, prematurely. So what you do is once you get to your bottle is you can put it in the freezer for about two hours depending on how cold your freezer is. All right, so now we're ready for step two. We put a couple of beers uh, in the freezer two hours ago and uh, let's see what happened. Now if you notice, this beer is already frozen. It's pretty useless. Um, you can look at the top, you can see there are some bubbles there it was kind of messed up when I put it in the freezer. So that's why it's really important to make sure that there's no bubbles in it while you do it. As you can see, this bottle is really cold, but it's still liquid. All right. Okay, so now uh, we're gonna pop the top and uh, see if this works. And you can see it's freezing instantly from the top down. Now what's happening appears to be an effect called super cooling. Uh, the beer is actually below its freezing point while it's in the freezer, but it remains liquid until some sort of disturbance, um, like slamming it down. And then at that point, the first ice crystal will form and then the rest of it's gonna freeze. All right, so now as you can see, the bottle has frozen. Uh, and boom, you've impressed all your friends. Unfortunately, this beer is now useless, so the last step is to get one of your friends to buy you one, because uh, uh, this thing's only good as an ice cube.